Hey everybody, Rob Satch from Feedback Ranch. I'm going to show you in 2020 what is an, a phenomenal way to integrate your Google My Business reviews into your WordPress website, your Webflow website, and even uh, they have a tool for Squarespace, I think. But how do you get your reviews? How do you embed your Google My Business reviews? How do you embed your Yelp reviews? How do you embed all of those different reviews out there? And I've found a tool, I've kind of used them all. And the bottom line is, is this can be really powerful. It's worth investing in, I think, to have um, as a business. So it's an app that you pay for. I think that you should pay, pay for good apps because they really matter. They do a ton. So here's a quick example of what it looks like when you have your Google My Business um, links in here. And, and I'll show you how you can do it with Yelp and Facebook as well. And you can even do it with Zillow and some of the other tools out there. So if you come in and look at this website that we have, this is just a simple landing page meant to convert for a Google Ads campaign. But when you come down here, you'll see here are our Google reviews. You can actually get them all loaded. When you click on them, you'll see that it actually opens up the Google review. It goes straight to the Google review and it aggregates it for us. It's super powerful. I really like it. Now this tool is only there because I'm an admin of this. So let me show you how you do that. I think the best tool, and the link will be in the description. I get a little spiff. This is my referral link. But um, the bottom line is, is that this tool you can use, you can do all sorts of reviews. So when it comes to reviews, you can do Google reviews. Um, you can grab them from all around the web. They have a testimonial site there, Facebook review, um, TripAdvisor, Trustpilot, Amazon reviews, Yelp reviews, Airbnb reviews, booking reviews, Apple Store reviews, G2 review, crowd reviews, and you can you can integrate that all into your website using some simple code and it will actually work. Um, now this is their uh, WordPress plugin, so they have a plugin that you have to use, it does have to be done right. And then they have, um, I use the, the Webflow one, so I'm just gonna show you on the Webflow what it looks like and uh, get logged in here. So essentially what you'll do is once you come in here, you'll hit application. Um, once you get the application rolling, um, you'll come into Google reviews and once you get the Google review, there it is, Google reviews manage. Um, I'll go in here and I'll just create one real quick. So I'm gonna create a widget and let's say it's for a new business that I've got. You can pick a couple different styles here. Um, so you can have one that would slide. You can have one that's just the scroll. It, it, it's mostly there. You can do a one unislider. You can get the grid. The grid is kind of cool. I think the grid is really slick to get lots of re reviews. You can have a masonry grid. You can get a list. You can do a sidebar widget that would, would be in a sidebar. So for now, I'm just going to do the basic reviews widget. <clears throat> And uh, what I'm going to name it real quick. So we'll do, let's just do Imperial Seal. And I'll show you how easy this is. So let's just move forward. Um, you'll search now for your Google Place ID. Now, sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. Right now, this did work. So I'm going to click on that name. Some new businesses in particular. Um, You'll have to come to, if you search location ID, you come to the place ID. You can search here um, where you put it in there. But I've even had it where new businesses are even harder to find. So I'm going to leave a link in this video to another YouTube video that I have where you can come and you pull up your, your, uh, your Google My Business. And what you do is because it's over here, you can actually inspect this. And I can't remember. I think you hit inspect. And then you look for there's like a data ID so what I'll do is I'll leave that video it's it's pretty easy but um, we'll just keep moving so I found that business um, we use these guys they're great we really like them now you can go into your layout and you can mess with the content with you got to be a little careful with that because when it becomes mobile you'll want to make sure that it's you know I usually do 800 just to make sure that I'm, I'm good Obviously, there's all sorts of settings that you can put there. When it comes to the review, you can do the classic look, a bubble look, um, or the spotlight. There's a bunch of different ones. I usually leave it pretty simple. Um, you can do short or full. And then you have the schema.org. I leave the schema on. And what schema will do is, um, again, whoop, whoop, whoop. Um, when you're searching for that business, because this has schema markup, it's putting in the Google review right there, which is super powerful, super helpful. Well, once you get that going, 
um, and you get this actually set up, you hit save. And for us, there's a little piece of JavaScript code. So you're going to copy that JavaScript code or you use the WordPress um, plugin. The WordPress plugin is pretty easy and you put it on your page. Once it's there, it works. Now, here's the deal. Um, pricing for this, it can get a little expensive depending on what you're going for. Um, I have all the apps because I use them all. You know, it's, I'm paying monthly because I use all of them. Um, but check it out. Their pricing varies pretty drastically. I think it's worth looking at. I think you'll like it. Um, in fact, I don't even know what it's at right now. <laughs> uh, but we use it. I mean, it's everything from 5 to $40 a month, depending on what you get. And yeah, I, I'm telling you, this is a sweet tool to embed Google reviews. Yes, you pay for it. And if you are hearing this and you're like, I'm never going to pay for an app, are you kidding me? These tools are, are ridiculously powerful. Now, if you only have one website, I get it, um, which is why you could work with us, but we're going to charge you anyways because we have to make a, lit a living. But support good software, and this is a really easy tool to use. Um, God bless. Good luck. I hope that helps you.